Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for, oh, I don't know, the next day or two. Y'all sitting on the edge of your seats, ready to see what's going to happen next? Yeah, me too. So, this ought to be interesting. Very interesting. We're going to start right here and see what comes up. One card, please. One card. This reading is not sign specific. I still get people that ask that question. Who is this reading for? Use your intuition. Try it. My work. All that glitters. All that glitters is not gold. What you see is not what you get. We got somebody here, perhaps two people. There's two masks here. Somebody may be presenting themselves to be somebody that they totally, totally are not. Looks like the masks are about to come off, though. The light is going to be shown on a situation. Notice notice the number up in the corner. It happens to be 16. And and in the and in the typical tarot, number 16 is is what? The tower. Get prepared. Get prepared for the light to be shed on a situation. If you are on the edge of your seat now, you might actually jump out of it. Something is about to be shown. Clearly, clearly. We have a couple of masks that are coming off. Be prepared. Because when that, when the shit starts to crumble, it usually crumbles pretty fast. You never saw it coming either. Somebody's falseness. Ha! It can only it can only be hidden for so long. If it's false, it's false. Lies can only be hidden for so long. Temperance. The time is now. There's about to be a renewal of some sort. This is an ex exchange. Exchanging what? Silver for gold or lead for gold, right? It's exchanging something for something better. So yeah, there's going to be an exchange. Absolutely. time it is time this is this is a card of evolution and this isn't this jupiter this is jupiter this is this is things really changing this is the jupiter coming in what is it that jupiter crossing the galactic center it's like it's that vortex in the black hole. You know, it's the energy coming out, revealing things, changing things, changing things for the better. But there's probably going to be some rubble. Oh, yeah. 
Oh yeah. Some things are going to fall down that black hole, right? There's a reason, there's a purpose, there's a purpose why things happen. To help with your own evolution. Queen of Cups reversed. And the Four of Pentacles reversed. Now this is somebody who is emotionally unavailable. This person is withdrawn, may play the victim. This person may try to play the victim here. You know, blame somebody else for what they did. I dare you. So we may have somebody here that plays the victim. Now this is opening up. This is sharing. It's time to let go of something that you have been holding on to. That's the Four of Pentacles reversed. Somebody's been holding on to something stubbornly that they don't love. They don't love it. But they've been holding on to it. Well, I, I, it's time to let it go. It's time to let it go. If you don't love it, <laughs> let it go. It's all about love. Red is a color of love. It is all about love. And that is what it's about. It's not about gold. It's not about things. It's not about what you can hold on to. It's about love. We got somebody here that is emotionally unavailable. They're about to, things are about to open up though. Things are about to change. They are. This person may play the victim. They may play the victim and say, oh, it wasn't me. It wasn't me. It was somebody else. Ha! Huh? Somebody knows. We got the high priestess here. Somebody knows the truth. This is an intuitive. This is somebody who is psychic or intuitive or whatever. This person knows the truth. They are highly aware of what is going on here. They see the situation absolutely clear, clearly. And this could be the higher power. This could be that Jupiter energy. Okay, somebody sees the situation absolutely clearly. And the masks are coming off. There's probably going to be some tears shed. It's going to be very, very emotional. Because it's like, it's like this is opening up. It's like what you've been holding on to or what you've been hiding. You can't hide it because it's a card of hiding in the upright. It's like you can't hide it. Oh my God, we have the magician. Somebody's been lying. They've been ma the magician reverse. Lying. This is a real trickster. Somebody who is very cunning and crafty. Thinks they can do whatever they want. But I think their power is about to be taken right away. This person is a master manipulator. Master. So we do have a master manipulator here. But we also have an intuitive who sees the situation, they see that they're being manipulated. Things are going to change. Six of the, so this master manipulator is going to get exactly what they deserve. Uh-huh. Yep. It's like something's going to be taken and given to somebody else. What is that saying? You reap what you sow? Somebody's going bye-bye. Somebody's leaving an emotionally unsatisfying situation behind. It's like I, it, they're leaving. And, and home is in sight. It's like, I'm, I gotta go. I gotta get out of here. I have got to get out of here. There's no love here. 
they're gone okay I feel as though it's almost like something is being eclipsed it's like almost like an eclipse of some sort this person has already made the decision it's like they're turning their back they're leaving somebody is leaving I think it's pretty much a split, split a quick decision as well. It, um, it looks like this person is, that almost looks like a wedding dress. So it looks like it was so close. It was so close. But I can't do this. I can't do this. It's like somebody decides, I can't. I, and I'm getting the chills in both arms. Somebody decides, I just can't do this. I can't. This is a lie. This is manipulation. So I think that somebody is going to suddenly, I think it's very suddenly, decide that it's, i got to get out of this situation. It's a complete lie. You will get what you deserve. So you reap what you sow. Queen of Pentacles reversed. Now the queen, this is somebody who is unstable. Very unstable. The Queen of Pentacles reversed. This person makes poor decisions. Has no money, has no stability, has no security. Can't hold on to any money by the looks of things. Very unstable. And this could be a mother. Defin I think it is a feminine. We have an unstable feminine here who has been manipulating. Or she has been manipulated. It could go either way. But she's also, I mean, obviously she's involved. She's unstable. She's insecure. And she may have jealousy issues as well. And it doesn't matter what sign she is. This is the energy of this queen in reverse. This could be anybody. We talked about it yesterday. This is an unstable feminine. I know that it is. Very unstable. She's probably scared. She should be. That she's going to get what she deserves. Four of Cups, definitely thinking about uh, very scared and discontent by the looks of things. We have somebody here that is worried. They're worried. What's going to happen? You're on the edge of your seat. And again, it's this, this is the same person. It's the same person. It is. She's, she's thinking about getting out of this situation. And I think she's going to do it. I do. It is the same person. So we have a person here that is thinking about, I mean, she looks very unhappy. It's like she, she, maybe she knows, maybe she knows that it's time for a change. So we definitely have somebody here that is thinking long and hard about leaving, but I think that she's going to, she is going, she's here too. She may decide to give to somebody else. It's like, I got to give it to somebody else. I got to. This is based on a lie. The magician reversed. It is. Especially if you don't love. I'd say this is the Knight of Pentacles. This is doing the right thing, doing the practical thing. I think there is going to be a message delivered or somebody is going to be delivering something. Because it looks like this owl is, and it's going to change everything. This owl is going to deliver this opportunity to somebody else. Somebody's going to make an offer of some sort. Owls are the symbol of change and death and the highest intuitive wisdom. I think we have somebody here that knows, but they're really discontent about leaving a situation. And maybe they are because the magician is reversed. That's somebody who wants to keep the power. 
wants to manipulate, doesn't like to give their power away. I want full control. Keep in mind, you reap what you sow. I think we have somebody here that is, that is being tested. They're being tested by the universe. Their character. Magician is a card of character. It's reversed. Their character is being tested by the universe. And the universe will decide based on their actions. This person is unwilling to take action. The magician reversed. It's like they're unwilling to take action because they don't want to give their power away. But they're definitely thinking about it. Definitely thinking long and hard. Probably thinking about the consequences that they will get. Four of swords reversed. Now there's a monster under that bed. There is definitely a monster under that bed. They will probably be haunted. Or they are being haunted. Somebody may have some some health issues and they may be... Uh, it's like they can't even get out of bed. They're so stressed out. So stressed out because they know. They know they have to walk away from a situation. But giving up that power and control, well... That's all ego. It is. It's, it's like they just don't want to let, let go of that power. But they are being haunted. And it's like they, they have, it's like all, all they want to do is sleep because they, they know, they know that they have to walk away. And, and it's like it's so hard. It's so hard to walk away from something because then you lose your power. You lose your control. I think somebody's also going to receive a gift because this is like a gift. Ooh, ooh, we have the we have the lovers card here. So this is a choice. Somebody has to make a choice. A choice between two options. Perhaps a choice between two lovers. Somebody could get caught, or they did get caught. You see, this person is catching two people together. So somebody may 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 have some sort of uh, gut feeling that their person is cheating or their person is sleeping with another person, and they catch them. Just saying that because that's part of the Jupiter energy as well. A lot of stuff is about to be revealed. Masks are coming off. There's a third party situation here. Absolutely, there is. Somebody may lie about it, though. They may. There's lies here. They may lie or whatever, but the truth is going to come out. Somebody's going to get caught. Somebody has been caught or they're about to get caught. There is a message that is going to be delivered. Somebody's not going to be happy. This is the sun card reverse. Somebody's not going to be happy with the message that they hear. Okay? They're not. It's the sun card. The light is going to be shown. There's probably going to be some sadness when, when, when this truth, whatever it is, is, is revealed. Okay? There's going to be some sadness. There definitely is. There's probably going to be some tears. There's probably a seductress here. Somebody has been seduced by another person. And, and it's like somebody's gut has been telling them, you know, you got to walk away. you got to go. you got to go. you got to go. you got to go. But... You know, then it's like you, 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 you know, rejection sucks, right? Rejection sucks and you give up your power. You know, you were lied to, you know, it's hard. It's really, 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 really hard. But the strongest person walks away with their head held high, especially when they know it's not love. To hell with the power and control. If it's not love. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Unless your ego is so big that you can't walk away. You've got to prove yourself. What did I do wrong? And that's this, this one right here. I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. Bullshit. Takes two to tango. So anyway, I feel as though... 
we have somebody here that is going to be saying, I'm out of this situation. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm going to go after what I deserve. My gut is telling me it's time. It's time for me to change. It's time for a change. So I feel like today is a day of some sort of secret being revealed or being accepted, being realized. This person's been thinking about escaping and I think they're about ready to escape. It's like I gotta, I'm, this, it's like it's, I gotta remove myself from this, these lies. I can't, I can't stay here anymore. It's not even comfortable anymore. It's so uncomfortable that I can't even get out of bed. I'm so stressed out. Somebody is so stressed out over the whole pile of lies and bullshit that it's, it's, it's basically killing them. Stress kills. So I feel like today or tomorrow or whatever, whatever this day is, somebody is going to be realizing or accepting that it's time to truly walk away. I mean, that is the meaning of this card. I'm going home. I'm getting out of here. Or I'm going someplace else. I'm going after what I deserve. It's like somebody has been holding on for dear life, trying to prove a point. This person has been miserable holding on. It's been miserable to hold on to this lie. It has. But it's like, you know what? They reached the point of complete exhaustion, frustrating, frustration. It's causing health issues. It's just like, I can't do this anymore. It's all a lie. Goodbye. So be prepared for somebody to say goodbye. They're getting caught. Somebody is getting caught or they did get caught. They got caught. And somebody is choosing to change. They're choosing to realize that this happened for a reason. There was a purpose for this. They're, start, they're choosing to accept. It's like they get some sort of clarity. They realize. They realize Maybe they decide to uh, make some compromises or to cooperate after not cooperating because they were under somebody else's control or their ego was so big that they couldn't let go of their power and control or whatever it is. We definitely have a trickster here that is getting caught in a lie and that's what I see and that, that's the truth here. And I do believe that we have two people coming together that are meant, that are probably meant to come together. There's a reason why all this happened. You know, people come into our life for a season and, and the and seasons change. So I feel like there's there's somebody and this is a card of consequences. Somebody is going to be suffering some some sort of consequences for their actions. They're getting caught by the universe. Good luck.